Okay, so I've come home. I brought my package and uh, I'm gonna open it. Look at this with you. Hopefully there's nothing inappropriate I ordered. I uh, do not think so. First of all, this one is going into the kitchen thing, the fridge, because I ain't going to drink it before I'm done fasting. Now, what about this beast? By the way, this is not a sponsored video. Um, I use this amazing Norwegian firm that is called Holbart.no, which basically means um, lasting, you know? And uh, there are any type of stuff that you buy at the store that goes beyond its best before date will be possibly uh, sold at this website because it's best before. So you can actually eat it afterwards. Many things are good after their date, in my opinion. That's my honest experience. I feel like I eat the best stuff ever and I get a great deal and they send like 20 kilo boxes like this. So, oh, oh, isn't that lovely? So, oh. Do you want to see everything I'm not going to eat? Everything that I'm going to torture myself with now? I bought this for a specific reason. You see that? That's sea salt, right? And uh, if you look at the ingredients, it says a mix of root vegetables, uh, which is a whole taro, beetroot juice, sweet potato, ruby sweet potato, uh, batata, yuca, parsnip, and uh, vegetable oil, which is uh, canola oil, perhaps not the best, and safflower oil, perhaps not the best, and sunflower oil, which is really good, uh, and sea salt, 1%. So uh, this one I deem healthy, enough for me to enjoy at some point in the future, maybe a month from now. Oh, how can I do this? I'm just gonna show you everything right now. This is an amazing tea. It's highly anti-cancer. Uh, it has anti-cancer properties, the sour sup, also called graviola. And uh, they sold this tea for like, I don't know, uh, two, no, less than two dollars, like one dollar. That's a cheap price in Norway for one amazing tea box. So uh, I bought a whole bunch of these uh, that is purely tea. And I bought some of these, which is organic. And I looked at the ingredients. It's uh, It goes above and beyond what I except some knekkebrød, crispy bread, I guess what you could call it. It's delicious and the ingredients are more than okay for me at some point in the not so distant future. And uh, this, co co coconut crystals, sugar, delicious. Also some chips, these are very basic and they have uh, wonderful uh, ingredients. Just potato, avocado oil, sunflower oil and sea salt, which I deem healthy for me when I want to enjoy it in the future. This was just a spice, a la Honda. I have no freaking clue what that's in, in uh, English, but I'll place it here until I get use, get to use it. Thank you for buying for the environment. Thank you. I am so agreeing to that. Oh, by the way, look at this. Have you seen these amazing products? Fluorescence, they usually cost like $40, 400 kroner. I got it for 150 or something. Thank you, I really love that. That's a very mild cleanse, by the way. Very uh, mildly cleansing the, the, the digestive system and the body with uh, just an herbal formula that has uh, done the test of time. Yeah, some salmon oil, K2, because omega-3s is great to have when I feel like it's needed. Vitamin B6. This one actually probably comes from my friend's online store, natur.no, like the Norwegian word nature, natur.no. He, uh, he, they, they actually have the best products I know of in that store. And uh, how lucky am I to see this product sold as a best before product. That is amazing. I think there's no one else in Norway who sells that brand, Wild Nutrition. Uh, yeah, my friend has done the research and it's uh, high quality. And this I'm looking so forward to create because I don't eat any wheat or white sugar anymore. And I try to uh, stay away from yeast also. This is bread, but with delicious, nutritious, highly amazing 
ingredients. It's uh, yeah, oats obviously. Everything is organic. Uh, some corn starch, which is a so and so. Uh, rice, mm, what do you call them? like rice flour? Yeah, and the brown something flour, which is a special, you know, special stuff. Buckwheat and such things. I think that bread will be delicious, so I bought two. I'm gonna clean this all up afterwards. I'm just showing you. And this one is in the same mix. It's an organic one that is sweet baked stuff. Pas pastries, I think you call it in English. I'm looking so much forward to a day when I feel like making that. I usually do not. Here's more of the graviola tea, more of the graviola tea, and some organic tomato beans. Beans in tomato sauce. These are pure, very good brand in Norway. Helios it means sun or something. Great stuff. Look at this goodness. Oh my God, I love it. These are the best. I mean, one of the best um, like diet bars. I don't know what you call it actually. I don't remember because I'm fasting and I'm in kind of in a fog right now. Do you understand that I am in a brain fog because my body releases toxins and eliminates it. I went through chemotherapy yesterday night. I was laying on that sofa uh, listening to a webinar while I felt like I was halfway dying because I don't know what happened. I just felt nauseous and it felt like chemo all over again. And I think the chemo stuff may have been stored in my fat because I went down um, seven kilograms in five days. On the fifth day earlier, I ate watermelon and stinging nettle, an herb wildcrafted nearby. So uh, that is amazing. Seven kilos in virtually four or five days. That's insane. So all that fat probably dissolved and let it, was let go off. And also water, obviously, and stuff that were left in my digestion system. So um, I think I'm just detoxing aftermath of chemo you know because i just when i feel that type of undesirable feelings in my body i seem to just tap out and i go to sleep i just fall asleep so i fell asleep for one hour i don't remember what happened during the webinar with my mentor joel bauer during these times uh anyway i feel great now and uh Let's see what more we have here. More of the tomato stuff. And uh, here is another type of these amazing bars of delicious organic goodness, pecan and carob. And those were matcha and moringa. And then I got some else, uh, a little fewer of this one, apple, cinnamon and baobab, baobab or something. By the way, if you wonder why it's a messy place here, it's because I don't even need an excuse, but I'm telling you, I'm a really creative person. When I do something, stuff gets everywhere. So I'm glad I'm having it this tidy anyway. It could be worse. And I'm definitely gonna clean this up in the near future and it's gonna be awesome. Oh my God, what a catharsis to, to sit down at a clean desk. Everything is organized and beautiful and I know where everything is and it's just everything I want and need, nothing else. It's gonna be great. Back to this. This is some organic uh, maize cakes, which is like a crispy corn stuff, organic though, not GMO. And this is cashew nuts with, I hope I, s yes, it's sea salt and uh, rapeseed oil. Oh, they're so good. They were actually quite expensive. Uh, $2.4 or something, 25 kroner. I don't think that was a deal, but it looked delicious and I'm not sure if I can manage staying away from it for too long. Maybe that will... Well, actually, I won't even say the word sabotage. They will uh, make the reward of fasting even greater. And I can't even eat them right after I start eating. I have to eat fruits for a long time. Ah, it's gonna be great. I, <laughs> I'm taking this one step at a time, people, my friends, my whoever watches this, what should I call you? My kindred spirit. That's what I want to call people. Maybe you're a kindred spirit if you're watching this. Yeah, oat, almond, drink. Something other than milk. 
oh my god these oh how could i do this to myself these are organic chocolate oat drink it tastes amazing and uh it isn't the cleanest product ever the ingredients have a little bit of this and a little bit of that i searched up all the e numbers and uh, i concurred that they would pass for this one time especially at a price of 10 kroner which is one dollar but uh it's gonna stay it's gonna no it's not gonna be hard actually it's going to uh, be a fun challenge staying away from those and uh here's amaranth seeds i have no idea how i use these properly but my mother made some rice type of amaranth seed thing that tasted totally different but was an awesome experience looking forward to use that more of this I, yeah, this was not a deal. It was still expensive, I think, but uh, it's great. Cocosa chips, and they are from one of the best brands ever. Tea, honest organic iced tea. If I want something to drink while I'm moving along, this is going into the fridge. I hope I'm boring you tremendously here. If you're still watching it, you can't be that boring. It must be fun to have an experience of opening a huge package, um, especially if you're at home during the Corona stuff. But I might post this after all that. Anyway, another drink. This was even less awesome than that one. This one is organic. This one isn't, but the ingredients are acceptable. It's stevia that is the sweetener, uh, mainly. And these are some omega-3 again. I like omega-3s. I think they're awesome to have whenever it feels right. I think that is all it, actually, but what is this package? Oh my god, what is this package? Tariai, what have you bought? A sterilizer? Are you going to become, you know, uh, able to make kids? No, I'm gonna have many kids, but this is an awesome product. It was cheap, uh, and I have no idea if I wanted it. I just know that it would be great to have something to clean jewelry watches my cell phone with yeah it's a cell phone sterilizer that is perfect and uh, i think it uses some awesome technology uh ultraviolet of course yeah okay cool so that's it basically i'm uh, looking forward to utilize this product never tried a sterilizer but it's gonna be great the phone i'm filming this from is going into this box before I even know it and if it doesn't work you won't see a video for a long time because that means that it drowned my phone but I don't think any water is going in here yeah wish me good luck I guess yeah and have a great day I'm going to go out there in the Sun I'm going to take my computer with the amazing seed of life thing on the back and uh, that huge yeti blue microphone and i'm gonna record text to no speech to text because i'm writing a book and uh i want it i want to complete it it's a short book but it's a book and i'm gonna be proud completing it anyway have a great day i love everything and anyone and no i really well actually i do at a core level but i don't like everyone i don't like everything i certainly have preferences and i hope you preferred watching this video have a great day you are awesome goodbye